There. What, I'm gonna, what do we do? Something there, bro. Someone or something seems That's to be peering out so at them from inside the house. Freaking like so the visuals the are there. You see it. Oh my god! Stupid hey, cat. <gasps> How's it going, everyone? It's Matt, and tonight we're gonna be reacting to another Nukes Top Five. This one is titled Five Scary Ghost Videos to Give You Nightmares. And as always, the link to the original video will be down in the description below. Let's get right into it. Top five ghosts call on camera. A playful spirit. Reddit user Bleachpong says that he and all his brothers have games experienced so a hurt. very bizarre haunting throughout their entire childhood in their family home. That's scary. They would often hear the sound of someone loudly digging through their large collection of Legos, even though there was no one else in the house. Late one night, they hear the familiar sound of shuffling Legos and run down the hall to record. I've had a few experiences as I was a kid, but I'd actually have to say probably more as a teenager than any other part of my life. Kind of just looks like a little haunted side room. Whoa. <laughs> that was a whole bunch of mumble jumble. Did you see it? There's nothing up here. A large Weird. Lego toy called a Bionicle seemingly Bionicle. turned its head to Fuck. look at the boys. That's nostalgic. There's nothing up here. I remember Bionicles when I was a kid. When Reddit users speculated that the toy was battery powered and that was why the head moved, Bleachpong posted close-up pictures of the toy's neck to show that there was no mechanical mechanism at work. So, is Bleachpong and his family haunted by a child ghost who just wants a child to play ghost? Legos? Or is it all a hoax? You decide. Look out. In this video, YouTube Ghost Hunters, the Holy Walkers, team up with several other popular YouTube ghost hunting channels to explore the haunted Medina Mansion in Florida. The house has a dark history as Mrs. Medina's life was taken by her husband in the home. Oh man. Included in the investigating crew is Franco TV. Sees crazy kind of looks like just an off-putting place. Urban, ghosts, urban exploration. Frank from Franco TV decides that they should try a seance, and then the things game get got together. a little spooky. Can you come closer to me? Question you want to ask. Can you make a sound? It's <laughs> so freaky. Don't move, don't move, don't move. It almost don't makes move. you wonder with that many people there. Are they kind of having something fake it a bit, or is one of them having somebody pull like some shit? To kind of be like, all right, let's make some type of ghost content because we can't just have no ghost content. Joe from Urban Ghost Urban Exploration suddenly says that his back is really burning. Guys, my back is burning. Okay, somebody cut up my back real quick. This will be good for the video. What is that? Oh my god, my back is burning. Feeling some kind of mark. Look at that. Looks like it's all. They seem just too yeah. calm and less like. like hit you like a there's a mark like right there. Yeah, there's a mark like right there. I can feel like something like burned my back. That's what it looks like. 
But by far the most bizarre thing that the crew catches on I mean, maybe this was is really paranormal activity happening. Window. Maybe he really was hurt by something or whatnot. Hey, 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 hey. Uh, look, look in the window. Look in the window. There's a head. There's somebody Fuck looking at that. us. Look in that window. Look in that window. No fucking way. Get the fuck out of here. Someone or something seems to be peering out at them from inside the house. Freaking like the visuals are there. You see Oh my god, stupid cat. I mean, I believe in ghost stuff, and I've seen shit with my own eyes, and but I almost feel like with like this many people and cameras and this and everything, I I don't really know if I really believe that this is actually truly happening on film. You know, it's like kind of makes you wonder: are they just faking it for the video, or is this real, real paranormal activity happening? Some bizarre shadow figure that looks almost like the silhouette of a young girl keeps peeking around the corner behind him. Fuck. So fucking did these that. ghost hunters catch real paranormal evidence? Or is it all an elaborate hoax? It's hard to say. You decide. Because I believe in this stuff, but at the same time... The house of the devil. Like, that just was too Ghost much. Ghost hunter Abdullah al Ambari explores supposedly haunted locations around his country of Saudi Arabia and streams them oh, live. Oh, God, I'm so jumpy Snapchat. right now. In this video, he's visiting a haunted house known ah. to local ghost hunters as, quote, the house of the devil. Yeah, you might expect, I'll, I'll pass. It doesn't go well. Oh my god. Gosh, I'm so jumpy right now. In the name of God. Oh, oh. I can't even see anything. It's just the noise and the shouting is kind of startling. Oh my god. What the fuck? No. And you run towards it? Stop like freaking out, or what happens? Is anything? What are you doing there? I feel like this is kind of set up at some point now. Abdullah al Ambari decides to finally just get out of there. You can watch more of Abdullah's adventures over on his YouTube channel or live on his Snapchat.
Ghost in the Cabin. Paranormal investigator oh, Ricky that already Blasky sounds like a scary enough title for me. Of a haunted cabin in the middle of nowhere. As he approaches the building, he you sees go there something at night. absolutely terrifying. Is he alone? What the hell? What the heck? Is that a person? I think there's someone up in that one window right there. Why would he run into the building? Amazingly, Ricky charges toward the building. <laughs> amazingly. He searches the structure, but he finds no sign of Noobs the strange is just so proud, like, window. amazingly, he just charged so straight for the danger. Ghost? Or did Ricky Velasquez somehow manage to fake a disappearing woman on an actual live stream? I mean, didn't really disappear. She just could have went to the side where there was more... I was second floor to that cabin. I mean, I don't really know, though. I'm not there. But that's going to be it for tonight, guys. I'll catch you on the next one. See ya.